So we have this manometric tube which is used to find the volume flow rate inside a pipe. So we have a stream of water in which we put this manometric tube and we see that there is a difference of height. So using this information we need to find what is the volume flow rate per unit time inside this tube. So in this and next many problems we are going to use two equations. One Bernoulli and whenever there is a difference in area, second equation will be of continuity. So let's do Bernoulli's equation between point 0.1 and 2. So P1 plus half rho V1 square is equal to P2 plus half rho V2 square. And we can see that pressure difference between these two points is rho G delta H. And which pressure is higher? This at second point. So P2 minus P1 is rho G delta H. So from here we get first equation that half v1 square minus v2 square is equal to g delta h. Now second will be continuity equation. So volume flow rate is same at both the points. So v1 s1 that is the volume flow rate at this point is equal to v2 s2 volume flow rate at this point. So we have these two equations and our variables are v1 and v2. So we solve that and we can find any one of v1 or v2. So v1 came to be this and our volume flow rate is V1 S1. So we'll put the value of V1 here and this will be our answer.